Hello, everybody. Welcome to PCB Ray Channel. This is Leslie. This is Louisa. Basically, LEDs are just tiny light bulbs which can easily fit into electrical circuits. But using our PCB wires project, they are not only light spots, but became an important part which combines the function of visual beauty and display. Yes. And today we are going to introduce some amazing LED projects made by our entire new PCB wares. Let's go check it. Our old friend Carl always makes fun and challenging projects, especially good at using flex PCB. Luisa. I found more and more PCB wires are using Flex PCB to make their projects. And do you know what's the main feature of the Flex PCB? Yes, the flexible circuit boards are designed for saving room and improving flexibility to meet a smaller and higher density mounting design. It also helps to reduce assembly process and enhance reliability. It's a huge move of PCB industry. Carl's first Flex LED as a try with lots of possible feedback. Then an upgraded version is born. This project is a POV display. Carl even programmed it to show a holographic hat as a Valentine gift. <laughs> Lastly, now I realize the romance of an electric geek. Yes, so sweet! Absolutely! For all the products, the subject and the carrier are both important influence elements. As to LED works, Aluminum substrate is also a good choice for its fast heat dissipation. And if you want to make an LED project, we highly recommend you to choose aluminum materials when place your orders. Good advice, lastly. Based on makers' different choices, the project's rendering effect is varied. For example, nowadays we must wear masks when hanging out. Yes. Jonathan made a mankind-friendly project to show expressions with a facial mask. Luisa. When we talk about the LED project made by Razor PCB, which one comes into your mind first? Mm, it must be Harry's PCB-based LED board. Oh, why? Because the unique of this project is that Harry assembled our PCBs to be a whole board. Wow, how could it be? By assembling flat PCBs and soldering the set to the side of the board, it becomes a 3D work. Wow, amazing. It's definitely a good innovation. Yeah. Here goes another 3D project. This PCB pyramid is made by Electrol Point. With the same mission to build a 3D work, he typed all the boards on the back of the PCB first, and then used everyone to strengthen the connection of two adjacent boards. Lastly, how do you think about this pyramid? I definitely love it. You know, it's a combination of the modern tech and the ancient architecture. Yes, that's so true. It's certainly an artwork. Yes. LEDs can not only be an artwork, but also with specific functions like addressable seven segment RGB display. Wow, Luisa, I often see it in sports events. Yes, actually, this project can also be called number indicator. Traffic lights is also on this principle. Actually, the displays are individually addressable, which means you can use only one data line to control as many displays as wheels. Then comes two similar projects. POV feature spinner and a holographic clock, which can show specific text numbers and patterns. Wow, lastly, this POV popular clock made by Malone looks so cool. And I remember he also have made a 4 times 4 times 4 LED cube. It's beautiful. Tap and Dry recently made a 8 times 8 times 8 times LED cube, which has more display functions. Beside this POV feature spinner, Shine actually makes full use of feature spinner and make a series of projects and I believe it's a good way to create new things. Lastly, actually I'm wondering how did he come up with this idea? That's what we call maker power. Our makers always surprise me with their creativities. Actually, I have a MK bag with battery. It can emit lights depends on the degree of sounds. And I think it's amazing. When I saw Worth Music Reactive Multicolor LED Lights, I know the secret of it. Delta Hack once made a police LED. Red and blue lights shine in the dark. Luisa, if you put it on your own car, it may be just a real police car. Then I will be a real police woman. Wow, you have a car! Yes, in my dream! <laughs> and Luisa, can you imagine a huge ping-pong LED wall controlled by our PCBs? 
It's unbelievable. Matthias, meanwhile, it consists of 1,920 ping pong balls as pixels and is controlled by an ESP32. The parallel data lines allow over 74 FPS and a camera level feed. The panels are easy to exchange in case of failure and built in bus lines. And the configurable mounting plates allow to build a display of any shape. Oh, lastly, it's undoubted a big project which requires enough persistence and patience. And I think it must be the most attractive project in the exhibition. Yes, and I wish we could have a ping pong LED wall in our next exhibition. Then I'm wondering whether Matthias will be willing to build another one for us. Ha ha ha, you wish. You know it's a huge project which takes him much time and efforts. But you can have a try. Matthias, if you are watching this video and have any idea about our proposal, just leave your comments, please. Lastly, there's another big project comes into my mind. The Bushies made a solar panel using thousands of LEDs, which behaves like a solar cell by exposing the panel by sunlight. Oh, bravo! Okay, guys, that's what we prepared today. And if you like this video, click subscribe and like, please. By the way, supporting projects is our permanent persistence. If this video brings you any inspiration or you have any project like this, just drop a message to sponsor at pcbway.com to get sponsorship for your unfulfilled projects. Go for innovation where I come for implementation. Bye-bye!